morning, you guys. What's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is a week in my life, New York Fashion Week edition, and I'm so excited to take you guys along. I'm just sipping my coffee, about to head out the door. Today is Wednesday, and it's fittings day. I just... I'm obsessed that I could say that. Like, I have fittings today. Like, that has been my dream ever since I was a little girl. Like, I want to go to fittings. I want to work with designers and get to wear their clothes and flounce them around the city. I know that sounds so cheesy, but... I am cheesy. You know, you guys know that already. A few of the shows that I'm going to, they're dressing me, which is a huge honor when the designer offers to dress you, and I'm really excited. So today I'm going to either like their showrooms or their stores to try on looks so that I can wear them to the show and represent them, which is so exciting. Today we're starting off at Retrofet in Soho, and then after that, going to La Pointe. Two brands that I'm very, very excited to be going to their shows. I like wear Retrofet all the time and I've worn La Pointe a lot as well. I went to the La Pointe show last fall, so I'm really excited they invited me back. And then later today, my friend Cassidy, who's a stylist at Moda Operandi, is coming back over and we're doing a final fitting. If you guys watched last week's video, you definitely should of me, like my first impressions of all the looks she pulled for me. And today we're picking like the top three outfits. And then we'll style them fully, like with jewelry bags, everything. Um, which is such, such a fun creative process. So today's a very creative fashion day, so I need to get in fashion mode. And yeah, I'm really excited to take you guys along the day. This has been my go-to like running errands outfit. You guys probably could have predicted this already. My Skims tee, I have a few of these now. A gold A jeans, a belt. So today I did this Oriam one. And then my New Balance sneakers. And it's really cold out, so I'm gonna wear my black wool coat. This one's Wardrobe NYC. Definitely an investment piece, but it has kept me so warm. And we're gonna do this little black YSL bag, sunglasses, we're good to go. Cause we gotta be comfortable, gotta be able to take the outfit on and off a lot since I'm gonna be trying on a lot of clothes today. Um, and I decided to put on makeup, which I wasn't initially gonna do. And then I was like, I wanna feel good in these outfits. So I like touched up my hair, did some makeup, but I'm excited, let's go. Okay, we have this look, which is like a dress and a bomber. This top is so hot. We have this. I love this set. I'm a happy girl. I got outfits that I liked and I feel so good in. Sometimes those fittings can be intimidating, but everyone today was so nice. And so just like, yes, that's perfect. Like helping me pull looks and it is beyond appreciated. So, um, I love my doorman. <laughs> they gave me one of these for my stuff. We're back. I have to run out again um, to get something that I got tailored last week. I love this hustle. I freaking love it. Like my team's texting me like, okay, like this jewelry brand wants to help style you. Like, do you have time to come in? I'm like, oh my God. Like, it's just so cool. Like Ring Concierge is gonna lend me jewelry to wear to one of the shows. Like that is just so cool that they want to. Like, I'm so honored. When I was leaving Retrofed, I said to the girl that was helping me, who was so nice, all of them there were so nice that worked for the PR team and they were just hyping me up because I do have to say with fittings and fashion week in particular and a lot of these designers, a lot of times they only have sample size because it's like from their showroom, it's what they're putting in the models. And I am not sample size by any means. I am a four, six, that's my size, four slash six. <laughs> And sometimes it like terrifies me to go in there because I'm like, oh my gosh, like I'm not gonna be able to fit into anything. Um, but I think a lot of the designers now, which is really great, are trying to be way more inclusive. And they're just also nice there. They're very like, oh, okay. Like I, I tell them I said, like, okay, these pants are super flattering. Like you're gonna love them. Like a lot, like I, I'm your size and I wear these too. Like, I don't know why, but like, it just makes me feel very comfortable, very good. Like no one's like, oh my God, you know? 
they make it work and they really do have a lot of options for me, which was really, really, really so nice. Yeah, I don't know, it's just like a little behind the scenes. Like there's definitely been times in the past where I go somewhere and they're like, well, we literally only have size twos. And I'm like, I'll take a jacket. <laughs> That's usually what I'll do. I, I'm like, I can fit in the blazer and then I'll just style around it, you know? And I'm fine to do that, but um, it's really cool that a lot of designers are more inclusive in that realm now. And I'm so thankful to be part of this fun. I've always dreamed of this and like every fashion week just gets better and better. Anyways, when I was leaving Retrovet, the girl was wearing this cute tank top that had a little martini on it. And I was like, that is so cute. And she said, it's so funny you say that because you have one in this bag and the invitation to the show. Retrofit at the plaza. They didn't say, they said location TBD, so I didn't know where it was. I just found, oh. Retrofit at the plaza hotel. Okay, then I'm glad. I went with the tan, like the brown outfit with the bomber jacket. It was like the dress with the bomber. And that definitely goes with the plaza vibes. I like need to take a picture of this before I even open it. But then they also gave me a tank top too. I didn't know Retrofet had cute little tanks like this. So look at the martini. Like, okay, I get an invite and a tank top. That was so generous. Like, wow. It, I am feeling run down last night. Like Brian and I both couldn't sleep. I don't know why. So woke up a little sleepy, which is not ideal. And I really, so I'm having an element. I want to stay hydrated. I'm taking my supplements just all the things, my armor, colostrum, like we're just, we're doing it all because we need all hands on deck because Fashion Week hasn't even started. I just added another fitting to my day. I was supposed to go to Alice and Olivia tomorrow, but tomorrow's kind of filling up. So I'm gonna go to Alice and Olivia today for the fitting. And uh, then all the fittings will be done. And like, today was the fitting day, which I think will be actually kind of nice. So one of those days where I might need to drink real caffeine. The decaf is just not, it's not working like in the slightest. Sunglasses as headband. Okay, I just took a picture of this. So now I wanna like open it. Retrofit at the plaza. They said this is their second show ever. I'm pretty sure if I understood that correctly. Ooh, please join us at 4.30 for pre-show cocktails. I'm so excited. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. This is, I, I'm saving this. This is so beautiful. I love a proper invite. Like, do you think I need to bring this invite? Fall 2024 runway, 5 p.m. the Plaza Hotel. I'm oh, sorry, pinch me, pinched. Quick pause for a smoothie ASMR break. out there it's like actually pretty cold out for the sun i'm not mad about i probably should be wearing a long sleeve shirt but i don't feel like changing and i love this shirt so much we're gonna head to alteration specialist i got a pair of pants tailored in my last vlog so we're gonna go grab those because need those for the final fitting today with cassidy and yeah just had my smoothie it was so good i needed to put my headphones on because it helps like literally keep me warm they're like earmuffs <laughs> No, I'm, I trust. Do you need a bag or anything? The sun feels so good. Setting up for my fitting with Cass. I have everything kind of like, I think these are the three for sure looks I wanna do. I'm just so obsessed. Like this moment, if you guys remember from last vlog, this and then this and then these two pairs of shoes and then all these items over here, we pulled a lot of things. That's my definite no pile. These are like maybes because I don't think I really want this outfit for fashion week. However, Valentine's day is coming up and like, I think I might keep this skirt cause I think it would be so cute with like little white tank and heels. I love that look. Um, Valentine's day would be really cute. Yeah, the more I look at this, it's just, I don't know. It's really cute because it cinches, but I don't, I don't think I need it. <laughs> Cassidy is here 
and the maybes have turned into yeses. I was showing them my maybe pile, and now I'm like, oh my gosh, so definitely keeping this because Valentine's Day. Cass was showing me a few ways I could style this. It's a black, like, leather midi skirt with a slit, and I just tried it on with that black skim shirt I was wearing earlier with a belt. So good, so timeless, day to night. Very, very happy about that. And um, gonna keep this dress because it's perfect for this nylon party I'm going to. And yeah, feeling good. I just love looking at that clothing rack. It's very pleasing. <laughs> Cassidy just left, I'm so excited. It's time for like a linner, late lunch, early dinner situation. I'm gonna do a neat clean bro. What's this? Taco bowl. Hmm. I'm like, what am I in the mood for? Oh, spaghetti and meatballs. I don't know what I'm in the mood for, actually. Maybe I'll do this. I forget what this is. I believe it's like ground chicken and rice. Yeah. We're gonna do this guy. Okay, food is nourished. I just put on a, a hoodie because it's a little bit colder out and it's just better to have layers. Um, and then I just have the same outfit on I had earlier. Gonna throw my sneakers on. We're gonna walk to this fitting because I've been like on my workout grind and this week it, I just don't see that happening for me. Um, so I'm gonna go for a long walk and that'll be my activity for the day. Oh, we're going to Alice and Olivia. We're doing a fitting. They always have such beautiful clothes. I'm gonna throw my coat on. It's in me packing. And then we're coming back, getting a spray tan and hibernating. We are charging up the social battery tonight because the next few days will be talk, 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 talk. <laughs> I just realized that my eyebrows were literally brushed down that whole clip, so just ignore that, please. We're tapped. Yeah, we're tapped. Can you need the white pump with it too? Nora's here. We're getting our Fashion Week spray tan. I'm so excited. Spray tan is done. It's marinating. Um, it's a couple hours later. About to go to bed. It's not even 10 o'clock yet, but I want to go to bed early tonight. I'm just really tired. Um, set out my outfits for tomorrow. We have Le Jean's tomorrow and then a Bondi Boost dinner, which I'm really excited about, and a nylon party. Um, and then I set out some of my other outfits there, but these are the fits for tomorrow. So I thought it'd make it nice. I hope when I go to bed, I don't get freaked out because I get spooked really easily. And like sometimes that thing and then and at night, like it looks like a shadow, it spooks me. So we're gonna see how this goes when I get into bed, if that spooks me or not. But yeah. anyways, tomorrow starts fashion week. I'm so, so excited. I'll see you in the morning. week day one baby at least this is my day one <laughs> okay i just did quick makeup i just tried the makeup forever hd hydro glow foundation it literally looks so good and the say do blush and baby i just put on my tiktok if you guys are wondering but very happy i just did like minimal glow because i'm actually getting glam later but i'm so excited i don't think i've talked about it on my youtube channel i've just been so annoying and i keep talking about this new series i'm starting by the time this vlog is up i believe i would have announced the series already it is called am uncovered and i'm so excited about it it's just for short form so instagram and tiktok youtube shorts probably and it's where i uncover various people's morning routines i'm so excited because i am so nosy and i love mornings you guys know like i literally wake up extra early so i can still have my morning i love seeing what different people do in their mornings it all might be similar but it's all so different at the same time and their motivation to get out of bed and like you get to see a little bit of their apartments as well or if they're traveling in we're in their hotel room i wanted it to be very editorial elevated style and i'm really happy with the first few episodes that we've 
made we've recorded well at this point i'm about to record my third and i'm doing another one this saturday that i'm really excited about um and the goal is to have on influencers people some of my friends that work corporate editors designers just all different types of people because everyone's morning looks different and it doesn't have to be your morning routine it's more so they're highlighting their four or five like non-negotiables in the morning anywho i'm excited because we're going to film miss kelly ann's morning routine this morning i'm so excited i'm just so thankful that she made time in her schedule to be on am uncovered like it's she's so excited about it it means a lot to me and i don't think she's like shown her morning routine anywhere other than like on her stories so we're about to head over there um so with that the person that i'm showing their morning routine they're usually they start off in like their loungewear sleepwear and then they change so i don't ever want my outfit to be like too much but i still gotta be cute so this actually is part of one of my fashion week outfits but this isn't going up till later, so I was like, let me just wear it. Gotta make use of this Prada tank top. Spray tan's looking good. I added in my clip and hair extensions from Luxie. Um, I have a code, I think it's still working, Danielle Carolyn, for I think it's 10% off. Earrings are Shashi, bracelets are Love AJ, and then I'm just wearing these black high rise loose jeans from Abercrombie. I've been wearing them a lot lately, I really like them. And just some black boots, and uh, I'm gonna wear a coat as well, because I think, like, Basically for these morning routines, I ask them to give me kind of what they plan to showcase and then I create a shot list around that. And one of Kelly's was taking the dog out. So I need a coat because <laughs> I think we'll be going outside. So I'm just so excited. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram or TikTok, go follow me now for just so much extra content. I mean, obviously YouTube is where it's at, but I post a lot more frequently on those apps just because it's quicker, shorter form. Um, but yeah, I really hope you guys are liking the series so far. By the time this video is up, you guys would have already known. So I hope the response was good because uh, I'm leaning in, baby. <laughs> All right, let's go. Then we're going to come back and we have two events today or three, three events. Back now, going to take a quick call. I think it's video. So I was like, let me just keep whatever makeup I have on right now. So with my team to go over like upcoming projects, I am uncovered, which I'm so happy I can probably talk about. Um, and then we're gonna let the fashion week events commence. Okay, I am making my smoothie, the highlight of my day along with my cottage cheese, of course. And I'm about to get my makeup done by a makeup artist who reached out to me and I'm excited. Her name's Kara or Kara. I'll ask her how she pronounces it. And then we're gonna get ready for the day. Okay, hair is being set. I just curled my hair with the extensions with the Dyson Airwrap and I'm like not brushing them through. I'm just gonna leave them. And then I put my two front pieces in rollers and I'm about to get my makeup done. So I just took my makeup off. Um, I'm excited. I just can't stop like pinching myself and being so grateful like i'm grateful to be busy during fashion like this is just so cool and i really just enjoy it and the key is to just not compare yourself it sometimes it feels like sorority rush you're like what's your schedule but i just like never ask people what they're i'm not like what's what show do you have after this like i just hate when people say stuff like that it, everyone is on their own journey it could be someone's first event and they're so excited like that's literally me i'm like oh my gosh i'm so happy to be here and this is my big event of the day so I just try not to, I don't compare myself to other people and I just really lean into the events that I get to go to because it is so freaking cool. So yeah, this is gonna be such a long vlog. I just know it, but we love a long vlog. We love a movie. Okay guys, Kara just finished and like, uh, I am not okay. Like she gave me the mirror and I actually was speechless. I need to show you guys the inspo I used. It was a photo of Madeline Klein, which she's stunning. So, you know, it's a risk, but like, <laughs> I want this to be my makeup always. This is the photo I showed her and this is the result. The skin is skinning. Kara, thank you so much. You wanna say hi to my so vlog? Welcome. Hi vlog. She's makeup underscore Kara on Instagram. She's a New York, New Jersey girl and you guys, I, I can't, I'm just at speech, so. Hey, now time to get dressed. <laughs> Still obsessing over the makeup. So here is my fit for Le Jeans. I am so obsessed with these pants. I really wanna see if they have other colors. They just snatch everything in so nicely and then fan out to a nice flare. 
I'm just wearing like my highest heels because I didn't have time to get these hemmed. And then this top is also Jean's. is this beautiful like tweed color. I'm literally not even wearing a bra. Earrings are anthropology. Like there's huge like organic shaped blobs that I love. Electric picks bracelets. That sun is hitting. And then we're gonna do this Bottega bag. And then I'm throwing over my brown trench because it's cold outside. So let's go first event. Let's do it. <laughs> Okay, quick change. I was there for like an hour, so fun. I had a glass of vino, it was good. Helped with the nerves, I can't even lie. Ran into Emily O's and Bows, or Emily O and Bows. We followed each other forever, like back when I like filmed preppy content and had a very preppy style here. Look at I right now. Um, and we followed each other forever and I don't think we've ever met in person and she's just the cutest little thing ever. Super quick change for the nylon party. I'm wearing this stud dress and black tall boots. This is one of the outfits Cass styled me in. Silver, I'm gonna throw a blazer over top. Going to the Bondi Boost dinner first and then nylon. So let's go to the iPhone. <laughs> Last night was so much fun. I'm headed to the Bumble and Bumble hair salon to get a blowout. I'm really excited. My hair hasn't been washed in a few days, so it's time. We got big hair energy today. I mean, look at that volume. Okay guys, hair is done. It's so voluminous. You guys know how much I die for a blowout, so. Very pumped about that. We're doing our own makeup today. I was actually supposed to do my base makeup and then go to Makeup by Mario and they're gonna do my eyes and lips, but the timing, I couldn't get the timing down as best as I thought I'd be able to. Um, so, we're gonna do it. It's really humbling doing your own makeup after you get your makeup done um, because for obvious reasons, because they crushed it. I'm so obsessed with the makeup we did yesterday. I need to start like tight lining more. Um, but today we have a runway show, which are always so fun. We're going to the Libertine show and then I'm going to come back and I have a, an hour or two, maybe like two hours, which would be nice. Actually, well, from there, I'm going to go and so to Soho and meet my friend Emily, who's a photographer, and she's going to shoot that outfit because I just love taking photos in Soho. <laughs> the outfits just look even better. I swear. If you ever come to New York, it's basic, but taking your photos in Soho just hits. And then, uh, I'm going to come back, chill a little bit. And I think I'm gonna wear the same outfit to this event for Moda Operandi tonight. It's like a New York Fashion Week kickoff cocktails and some of my friends are gonna be there. And then we're gonna go to Jeans after, which is this like new New, new York hotspot that I am particularly excited to try and see. And I think they're doing like a Fashion Week party too that they told us we could join for. I don't really know how long I'm gonna last tonight. I don't think it's a big drinking night, like maybe just a drink. And then I'm gonna come back and Ryan and I are gonna watch the morning show and chill because we have another busy day tomorrow. I'm just trying to like sustain my energy. 
So I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm kind of tempted to use this Makeup Forever HD Hydro Glow. I used it the other day and it's so nice. But also like my Giorgio Armani is my tried and true. So maybe I'll do that. This was really good though. I don't know. But I need to go with my beauty blender and get ready quickly. Okay. I literally just had to ask my next door neighbor if she could help me zip this because I couldn't myself. So, um, <laughs> if you want, oh, here I am tripping on my shoes. I didn't put them on yet. I love this outfit so much. I just did pretty simple makeup. I might wear sunglasses. Everything's from Mode Operandi. Cass styled me. Earrings are Bonamon, a little white button down. Dress is Stella McCartney, but I love it because it has like a corset inside. So it really nicely shapes the figure. We're gonna do black heels and these black YSL sunnies. Hoping to get some like street style, it's not street style, but like street photos. Mm -hmm. Like that'd be cool. And I'm using a white bag. I'm gonna pack my bag. I'm gonna put a granola bar in my bag because I feel as though I'm gonna get hungry, but I'm excited. First runway show, let's do this. Sex Lives of College Girls is on, and I just, woo! Today was so fun because the show, the venue, as you guys saw, was absolutely stunning. Like, it was what you think of Fashion Week. I feel like when you see it in the movies and just in Europe during Fashion Month, I'm just like, that venue was so big, so grand, and it was cool because everyone is sitting in the front row at this uh, show because it's like huge. I'm heating up some food right now I'm Gonna eat and watch TV kind of decompress and then we're gonna do a little day to night situation Where I'm gonna put on that dress again, but just no white button down. So it's like a Nighttime look and we're going to the moda operandi like New York Fashion Week cocktails kick off and Then I think jeans for dinner. So it'll be good um, But this was today was really cool because I like pulled up and there was a ton of there were a ton of street style photographers out there and they all like wanted my photo because i think this is like my best outfit honestly that i've had i really love it so much and my team even was like oh my gosh like this is the fit so cassidy crushed it um i felt really good in it and it's just like it's cool and photographers are like they don't know who i am but they're like i love that outfit that she has to be somebody i'm not but it is definitely an honor and it was just fun. So I'm gonna decompress, charge my social battery, and then, yeah. We are loading up on everything. I am chugging an element. I am about to take one of these Symbiotica vitamin Cs, and I put Armor Colostrum in my element because it's on, I have the unflavored one. I'm not getting sick. I'm not letting it happen because I feel like everyone's sick, and I wanna stay healthy, so. Okay, so I need Cassidy to help me in the car. She's picking me up because the extra corset part in here is really hard to do. I switched to a side part. Was feeling it. Um, but yeah, we took off the white and button down. And I switched to these black pointed toe heels because they're just a little bit comfier. And some jewelry. And then I'm going to throw a blazer over top. But we're going to go. I'm so excited because... The event tonight's at the Fifth Avenue Hotel. I've been dying to go. It's supposed to be stunning. And I'm excited to see who's all there and have a lovely evening. Here we go. Woo! I've been wanting to come here. I feel like I manifested. Good morning. My hair still has so much volume from the Bumble and Bumble blowout. Um, I've had the most lovely morning. Ryan slept over last night. We watched The Morning Show, which is just like our new show we watch. It's really fun. 
I'm sure you guys know like when you're in a relationship and you find a show that you're both excited to watch so he came over after my dinner and we hung out and it was just really nice wholesome time and he just left and now I like thought I'd wake up feeling super tired and I'm not which is really great um, I'm in my PJs I'm about to change get ready because I'm having cast Miko founder of Orium Collective and she's also a content creator I followed for years I'm having her on AM Uncovered this morning. I'm so excited to see what her mornings are like, and I'm just so obsessed with her. And she's in town, she lives in Miami now, so she's staying at Fouquet's, which is like this beautiful hotel in Tribeca. So we're doing like her New York Fashion Week morning routine. I'm just so excited to learn more, um, but I do need to clean a little because today is going to be such a crazy day. It's like back to back to back, changing glam, all the things. We have the La Pointe show and the Alice and Olivia show today, and I'm really excited about it. Also guys, Moda, the event last night, there were goodie bags. Look how cute this bag is. New York Fashion Week, I love it. This is the most massive deluxe goodie bag I've ever gotten. First of all, this bag I'm gonna be using, but Moda Beauty has the nicest products. Like, I've been loving You Beauty recently. So there's like You Beauty, there's Westman Atelier, there's brands that I don't know, Tata Harper. I'm like, oh my God, a little scrunchie. This is a dream, I can't wait. I'm, I've never tried anything by Westman Atelier, so I'm definitely really excited. And I've heard good things about this brand, the masks, 111 skin or 111. So we love that, but I need to make my bed and clean a little because I, we're, I'm i gonna have people here later because I'm getting my hair and makeup done. And I don't know, I just wanna represent myself well and my hair, let's do this. Okay, about to head out. Just did super light makeup, a little mascara. Of course, I had to wear Orium Collective, so I'm wearing these earrings. Like, this is a very Castamico outfit, honestly. Um, just this black top from Maritzia. Pants are TWP, and then I'm wearing my Orium belt, and just some ballet flats. I'm gonna pop a coat on, um, but <clears throat> I always try to dress, like, somewhat chill because, you know, they're slowly getting ready through the day, and at the end of the video, they're usually ready but I don't want them to feel uncomfortable like in their PJs and I'm like in a fit so um I think this works we're gonna head over I'm excited just finished shooting it was so fun I love Cass so much and I can't wait for you guys to see her morning routine and now I'm just walking back because I was like you know what it's not that cold out and this is gonna be my workout for the day so Tribeca really is so lovely I think I'm gonna stop into La Cologne because it's nearby and it's nice to have a little beverage on your walk. Just made my favorite smoothie. I had one banana left, so I was like, let's make one. Hair and makeup is about to be here. We have another fun day ahead. Hello, everybody. Gibbs is here, Jackie's here, Ooh. vibes are good. Finishing up hair. I love having this mirror here, it's actually very fun. <laughs> We are safety pinning up. We've got a whole squad okay. behind the scenes. Okay, guys, here is the final look. We moved the mirror out here so she could like look in the mirror while she was doing my hair. But I love this. I love the point. I love this fit so much with all the jewelry. It's all from Ring Concierge. So shout out Ring Concierge for letting me wear some beautiful jewels. I love the necklaces. I ended up doing two like different statement earrings but i think they look good all together especially with the half up half down we're ready to stunt on them i'm excited changed for Alice and Olivia. Totally different vibe. So we have this beautiful dress on. I love it. And then some sheer tights. These are actually the sheer text tights. I've always wanted to try them because apparently they don't rip. So we'll give that the test. And then this coat over top. And I kept some of the same jewelry 
because it's so pretty. So we've got the ring concierge earrings and the rings. And we're gonna, and Colby's coming too. So we're gonna go together. I've been on FaceTime with Delaney for two hours. I'm like, I'm gonna go back and charge my social battery. Nope, talk to Delaney for two hours. I ordered myself, literally myself, me, myself, and I, a Domino's pizza. I just, I didn't want New York pizza. I wanted Domino's pizza. I don't know if you get it. It just reminds me of college and I'm in my pajamas. I'm gonna watch Sex Lives of College Girls. And that is my night. Good morning. It's Sunday, Super Bowl Sunday. I have no shows, no events today. So we're going to Pilates. I'm going with Colby and Katie. We're going to someone named Magda. She used to teach at New York Pilates and now she's teaching somewhere uptown and we're gonna go do like a little private Pilates, reformer, reformer Pilates with her. So I'm excited, it'd be a nice way to start the Sunday. So I'm wearing this little set active jumpsuit and then my Pilates socks cause they have little grips. Um, and obviously I'm gonna put on a jacket. I put like Divi scalp serum in my hair. It's a hair wash day. It's giving clean girl aesthetic. <laughs> um, but I slept so many hours last night. I just had the lo loveliest night. I started the movie Upgraded on Amazon Prime because everyone was talking about it. And I did really like it. I haven't finished it because I got tired. But yeah, Super Bowl Sunday. So going to a friend's house tonight to watch that. And we're just gonna have a wholesome kind of Sunday reset day. So I'll be vlogging like a little bit, but this is a fashion week vlog. So I wanna keep it that theme but i had to say hi so just popping in <laughs> post pilates how are we feeling my body is still shaking <laughs> we're gonna be shaking tomorrow colby under her jacket is wearing a justin bieber shirt i'm manifesting <laughs> fingers crossed manifesting him at the halftime show we're in the upper west side it's so lovely we're gonna get a coffee and be wholesome so. <laughs> went to Helena Collection. I really want to do fake bangs for both of my shows tomorrow. Um, kind of like how Sabrina Carpenter's hair is like wispy bangs, put in my hair extensions, make it a whole vibe. And I walked in all of, I mean, she's done Sarah Jessica Parker, Blake Lively. She has photos with so many celebrities in there. And she was like, normally I need like days to do this. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Cause my hairstylist told me like, no problem. You go in and she like matches them to your hair. Like she's literally going to color the bangs squeeze some of the hairs out so it's more wispy. And she was like, you're lucky today. I'll do it for you today because I need them tomorrow. So um, <laughs> I felt so bad. I was like, I will send you so many photos. It'll be so fun. I paid for it, but like, I was like, I need it for fashion week, please. So it was a fun, cool little experience. Now I'm on the hunt for a juice generation. I think there's one nearby, I think so. Showered. I feel so good. I'm literally watching the area runway show on Instagram live while I'm waiting for it to to start. But my bangs just got delivered. <laughs> it only took her a couple hours. ASMR. I did. Oh my god. She did an incredible job. How'd she do that so fast? Okay, good. So she thinned this out a little bit and like literally plucked hairs out so it was more, I'll show you guys the inspo that we're going for. Going for like Sabrina Carpenter vibes, J-Lo. So like wispy, thinner bangs. But my hair is blonde, but the roots are pretty dark and you don't want it to look just like a blonde triangle in the front. So she did the damn thing, wow. Helena is amazing. And I like how there's some hairs in the back too, so it really blends. This wasn't cheap, but my goal is that I will, you know, wear these more than once, obviously. 
wearing them for two shows tomorrow. I'm so excited. It literally just has these clips in the front. I'm becoming such a clip-ins girly. Of course, I just washed my hair, so I can't like test it out, but I'm about to do my hair and blow dry it, so I'm so excited. It came in a nice little box and everything. She like had it on this lovely, I have to send a picture to my hairstylist who's coming tomorrow. <laughs> This is so funny to me. Delaney's trying on the bangs. Do we have same hair color Why these days? Why does that work though? Oh my god! Like I love that. Delaney can't stop staring. <laughs> I was <laughs> like, wait, should I get bangs? I think you've been talking about getting curtain bangs. Oh, I'm glad she did a good job. Because when I tried them on, Delaney, they were so thick. Oh. So she like plucked. Well, you gotta figure out because they're the placement the is still showing. But if I did them any lower, they'd be way too low. Oh, uh, well, they look. Fabulous. Wait, we're styling Delaney for the Toronto Art <laughs> Show. We're Please styling, styling Delaney you free. Gotta look good for the gals. Well, I was. she was like, I don't know what to wear. And I was like, just come over. I probably have something you could wear. And I said, go on my OOTD highlight on Instagram. And that I did. And that she did. And she liked this outfit I wore on Christmas Eve. And it <gasps> looks so good. Slay. It looks so good. We've got Obsessed. the lace pants. I love it. With love your it silver heels. With my silver heels. Is, this Is it too hot? Yeah, that's perfect. Too hot? Like, are you uh, no, toasty? No, perfect. She'll be selling merch. Cold. Oh my gosh, yay. Oh, Love. Dip is being made right now. Okay, guys, here's the Super Bowl fits. White tank, jeans, red sneakers, because both teams are red. So I thought that was easy on the way. Or a 112's hat, and it has like red script in it, so I thought that was good. Sweater is Cezanne. I feel like it's a cute little vibe. I did some hoop earrings. I have those touchdown earrings, but they just didn't look good with the hat, so. Yay. We've got a little Taylor Swift shrine here. Whole thing. Here we go. I say it, go. Oh my god. Who's going? He's going. Good morning, everybody. We are placing the bangs. We are trimming and priming and propping. <laughs> I'm so tired. Um, we have two shows today. I'm so excited. Kat's here, Jackie's here, and I'm so excited about today's them. Oh my god. <laughs> what do you guys think? I'm so obsessed. Today's been a little, it's not been chaotic. I just like feel weird constantly vlogging when they're in here. Um, we did the clip-in extensions from Luxie and then my bangs and they're perfect. And we did just like, cause I'm obsessed with liner now. Oh my God, I have to pack my purse. Wait, actually I'm kind of in a rush now. I'm so obsessed. We have the retrofit show at the Plaza Hotel, which I think is gonna be stunning. You guys saw I tried this on at the fitting and it's just so perfect. The shoes I panic bought yesterday at Nordstrom are absolutely perfect. I love a pointed toe. I feel like it's just so flattering on the legs because I do get self-conscious wearing short dresses sometimes, but I feel good. And I'm really happy and I'm really grateful to be invited to this one. I keep pulling up my dress, which is not ideal. I need to not do that. Maybe if I put on like sticky boobs, it'll stay. But yeah, I'm headed to meet my friend Isabel because she's going as well and we're gonna like, there's like a cocktail hour or a cocktail half hour before the show. And I just wanna like eat this up. I'm so excited, so let's go.
Danielle tonight was like, Danielle? Like they kind of knew it was me, but they weren't sure. I am so obsessed with my hair. So many people responding like, I hope that they're real. I love them, but my hair's not naturally straight. So I already know, oh, this piece I need to like. I already know that it would be so annoying to style. Like when I was younger, I had bangs and it just was really hard to style. Anyways, I'm about to change into my next look for the Laquan Smith show, I'm going with Cass and Kelly. So that'll be really fun. And I think we might be going to the after party after, but I'm gonna make some food. We're gonna do an eat clean bro meal. Cause I love it. This is one of my favorites. It's the um, Korean beef and rice bowl. So I'm gonna change and eat and rest my feet. But it was so, the show was, Amazing. I mean, everything at Retrofit, I just, I wear a lot of Retrofit already. Like, I just love it so much. The presentation was done so well, and it being at the Plaza Hotel was just so cool. And I was just so thankful to be there. Okay, next look is on deck. Such a different vibe. Oh my God, I'm like so obsessed. Who is she? Um, no, actually, my door woman was like, didn't recognize you. Okay, you guys remember this outfit from last vlog with the styling? I wonder if this one, like, I should take off. So it kind of covers the Prada. Um, so yeah, we've got this moment. I'm excited this outfit involves a jacket because it's nighttime, so it's getting a little bit colder. I'm so excited to go. Oh, and I rented this on Pickle. It's a Colt Gaia clutch, which I think I need to purchase because it literally fits my phone in here, which is so rare for clutches. And it looks so good. Like it's just, I mean, obviously there's no shoulder bag, like per, uh, strap on it. But yeah, that's one of the reasons I love pickle. You can rent the cool stuff. So I'm gonna head over to meet Cass and Kelly and go to the show. I've always wanted to go to the show and I'm so excited. I feel like it's gonna be so cool. So that's that. I feel like this vlog is like, okay, I'm home. I'm in a new outfit and then a couple clips out, but hopefully it's better than nothing. I hope. <laughs> We had the best night, the show was amazing. And then we ran into Tasha, and we were like, are you going to the after party? And she was like, I mean, let's all go. So we went, we went to Ludlow House first, then we went to the after party, which was at the box. And I really have been wanting to go to the box because everyone talks about it. It's like this iconic speakeasy vibe place in the city. And it's apparently like crazy stuff happens there. And so we went there and it was so fun. Um, now I'm sitting, oh, we also got goodie bags. And one of the things in the goodie bags was this perfume, specifically this brand I've been wanting to try. This one is Vanilla Oud, and I'm really excited. So I was like, I'm bringing that home. But guys, I do not want to take my hair out. Like, I have clip-in extensions, and I have the bangs. I'm not ready to let go of this identity. But I got, I got a good use out of the bangs for the day. I just, like, I don't want to take them out. Like, I kind of want to, I just want to like go to bed like this, but guys, tomorrow it's supposed to snow, so I canceled my morning. Like, I'm pretty sure, I don't know. I, was, I had one more show tomorrow morning, but kind of decided I don't, it's at 9 a.m. I'm excited. I wanted to go because I had an outfit I was excited about and I really like this brand, but I do believe it's gonna be snowing when I wake up. So with that, the New York Fashion Week February 2024 season has come to an end. It's like the TikTok sound. Um, I'm just gonna sit and stare at my hair a little bit longer. And I'm gonna take it out and I'm gonna go to bed. Um, thank you guys so much for supporting me through this and supporting me through this, that sounds so dramatic. Like supporting me because it allowed me to do stuff like this. And this stuff makes me so happy. I love fashion. I love getting more into the world of it all and meeting people that do some pretty amazing things in the fashion world. So I'm very, very grateful. And it's all thanks to you guys. And I hope this vlog was some sort of fun for you to watch and kind of get the inside scoop on, but I'm just feeling grateful. So 
I love you guys. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time for our next video. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.